Look who showed up ready to slay. And plot twist, y'all, Karina came to do the slaying today. Shorty was playing no games, got herself really comfortable, put on my apron, and was ready to get started. I'm not gonna lie, it felt kind of nice being on this side of my nail desk. So although I sent Karina a million different Christmas nails, the reality was that New Year's would be in a few days, and I've been dying to use these new silver and gold bow charms I got, and I found the perfect chromes to match them. But anyways, Karina got right to work and started cleaning up my cuticles. And if you notice that my nail beds are red, don't blame Karina. I ripped off my nails the day before. And I know, I know, y'all. I'm always preaching not to rip off your nails But your girl was taking six to seven people a day And I had no time to soak off my previous set The holidays are the most busiest time for us nail techs So for this month, I didn't mind risking my nail health In order to squeeze in an extra client or two And I know a lot of y'all are probably asking Like, why doesn't she do her own nails? But if you've been here before, you know I absolutely hate doing my own nails Not only does it take me like two business days But I can't do certain designs with my non-dominant hand And don't tell Karina, but sometimes I actually do enjoy her company But all jokes aside, Karina was so nice and so supportive When she found that I did nail when we were working in the same nightclub there was always nothing but love and support and not one ounce of competing against each other period and side note for all my clients out there you see how i have my armrest this is how your arm should be on the armrest and this is how your thumb should be when you are drying it you'd be surprised how many times us nail techs have to redo our clients thumbs but anyways before i knew it karina was done putting on my base coat this is literally one of my favorites and i know what y'all are about to say but i am such a hypocrite because i do make karina do french almost always but for me french is like a little treat because i'm not able to get my nails done by her all the time but hey at least i don't get a basic french and i always add a little razzle dazzle in there so i wanted one hand to have the silver chrome and one hand to have the gold chrome and then it was time for my favorite part which was adding on the bow charms i literally love charms and i'm always trying to convince all my clients to do them and if you're wondering what that spray is that karina is using it is linked in my amazon storefront it helps make your charms last so long and is this how y'all be feeling because i was getting so aggy sitting here but i can't even complain because we were done within two hours but we were finally on our final steps karina just wiped off the remainder of the chrome and then file them to make sure they were extra sharp and of course we went in with one of my top selling cuticle oils which is bizcochito it literally smells like a sweet vanilla cake coming out the oven but anyways look how cute these came out y'all like i was obsessed and i love the fact that i was able to do one hand silver and one hand gold because i could not decide but once again my girl karina slayed it period these were literally so cute i am obsessed thank you karina